A Tory activist has suggested not all party members support an early general election after Boris popular conference last week. Keith Rowe, political commentator and Conservative Party activist has told Daily Express not all Conservative Party members are entirely supportive of calling an early general election. Speculation is rife Boris Johnson could call an early general election in 2023 before the end of his full term. Oliver Dowden, the Conservative Party chairman has not ruled out an early 2023 election. Mr Dowden said, the PM has told me to make sure that the Conservative Party machine is ready to go for an election whenever it comes. In 2017, Theresa May was heavily criticised for calling an early general election which lost her parliamentary majority, resulting in a Conservative-led minority government with a confidence and supply agreement with the Democratic Unionist Party. An election could be called early as the Fixed-Term Parliament Act of 2011 is set to disappear. The latest YouGov poll from the 5th to the 6th of October puts the Conservative Party at 39% and Labour behind at 31%. With the removal of the Fixed-Term Parliament Act the Prime Minister could call an early general election before May 2024 without needing at least two-thirds of all MPs to vote for an election. However, political commentator Keith Rowe admits despite strong polling not all Conservative Party members he spoke to during the party conference endorse an early election. He said, the members I spoke to did not want Boris to call an early election, even if the polls show us riding high. Mr. Rowe added, I think that in the main the members would rather wait a while if possible, however, Boris Johnson was criticised by some at the conference last week for not announcing a mixture of new policies. Among the few policies announced were a new £3,000 levelling up premium for talented maths, physics and chemistry teachers to go and work in areas most in need. Mr. Rowe admitted despite a lack of policies introduced at the party conference, more clarity was given to existing ones. He said, there was no massive burst of new policies launched at the conference although there were some. For example Preeti Patel gave very clear assurances regarding the current wave of illegal immigration. There was a lot of increased clarity around the direction and detail of the main policies. From the crowd's reaction I do not think that further policy announcements were needed for the speech. There was genuine support for what the PM said and his delivery was second to none.